Hey guys, it's Nikki. <laughs> Welcome back to a crazy stress video. Let me grab my coffee. Guess what? If you guys have already looked at the title, you know it's moving week. Well, technically, I have a week until I move. So, um, but yeah, you, you guys know what I mean. I have a week until I move, so I have this week, and then all of next week, and then I move next Saturday. So I have like a week, a week and a few days until we officially are moving into our new townhouse. Oh, I have so much stuff to do. There's actually a lot of stuff that I really need to get done. Um, like, it's actually been kind of crazy. Um, I'm about to go to Walmart because I need to get, um, like plastic cups and plastic plates because I'm doing dishes in the dishwasher right now. I have some pans to wash in the sink, which I will do when I get back, and I am going to start packing up my dishes so I can get the kitchen packed, and then I'm going to go to Home Depot right after Walmart because they're right next to each other, and I'm going to get like bubble wrap and saran wrap so I can start bubble wrapping my picture frames and saran wrapping like big stuff and everything, and we can start putting them into boxes. Yesterday was actually my birthday. Today's March 2nd. March 1st was actually my birthday and um, I turned 22 and it was a lot of fun and I'm just very over the moon about the love and everything I received. So I'm just so thankful for my friends and family that were there for me for my birthday. Yeah, lots of stuff to do today. So I'm gonna take you along with me for the next week and a half because you guys are gonna see these and then all of a sudden it's gonna be moving week so it's gonna be kind of crazy so yes let me just finish getting ready and I'll be out the door in like 10 minutes because I'm just gonna do my skincare throw a headband in my hair and then I'm gonna throw on a very comfy outfit for today and we're gonna go to the store and then when I get back we're gonna turn on a movie and we are going to set up boxes, pack, and be ready to go. So let's get started with movie week. All right, you guys, it's a little bit later and I kind of want to share with you the updates that we got going on here. We have a lot more boxes. Um, I've completely taken everything off of this table. These are Jason's sunglasses that he left here last night. So I got to give those back to him. I've taken everything off of there. I've taken everything off of these walls. This I'm gonna start working on later. Taking everything off here, and then I'm gonna start taking all of this down here um, and start wrapping this. But I'm gonna start wrapping like this in saran wrap, a few of those pictures in saran wrap. And then this is all like stuff that I'm going through. That's kind of just where everything's sitting right now. Um, this I need to pack away as well and then just the stuff that's on it. So we're actually making a lot of progress. Um, I'm actually going to start working on this storage closet right now. So that's kind of the main thing that I need to do at the moment. And yeah, so I've literally just been like packing, packing, packing galore today. Um, I think I'm going to take a little bit of a break here shortly. Um, and kind of do some like phone calls for utilities and stuff. I just have a few more that I have to transfer over so that won't take very long. But yeah, so this is kind of what we're working with right now. And then once I get everything packed that I need to get packed, I'm gonna kind of organize the boxes in a way that um, it'll be easier for everyone to walk through and also too, so I can also get some of the furniture moved out like the tables and stuff, so. Yeah, this is what we're working with right now. So I'm super excited at the progress. Um, I know I only have a week and a half left, but I'm super excited to see like how much I'm getting done today. And then I'm going to continue to do that through this week. And it's honestly just going to help so much when it comes to next week because I won't really have to do as much. Hey guys, so it's been like quite a few days since I've vlogged last. I'm actually on spring break for school this week, which is great it's a beautiful day out today it's gonna be like in the 70s it is gorgeous so i'm actually about ready to go look at the new place like i'm gonna go do the walkthrough real quick uh jason is at work i don't work until tonight and tomorrow night but jason is at work so i um 
I've decided that I'm gonna go do the walkthrough today. He trusts me, I'm gonna take pictures. I'm gonna take videos so that way he can see it and everything and yeah. The place is looking naked as you can see. Like there's nothing hung up back there. That mirror, it's like screwed into the wall. So once we take the screw out, I'll be able to take that down. But yeah, it's looking super naked. Honestly, I'm just like really happy though that like it's officially time to move because like obviously this has been like the most stressful month ever, but we are here and we're officially moving this week. So yeah, I'm excited to be in the new place. All right, you guys, so I kind of want to show you where we are right now. We've got pretty much all of the furniture wrapped and taken apart. We have about a couple days until moving day, three days technically. You know, I've got everything off the walls and this is kind of what the living room area is looking like. Let me take you to the bedroom. The bedroom's a little scary. Um, oh, I have my fan on. Let me flick this light on here. The bedroom's a little scary looking <laughs> because I've got all the clothes that I need to like go through and pack and like my shoes and stuff. And I've got like dust bunnies from my bed and everything. So yeah, this is kind of what we are working with right now. But yeah, I'm super exciting. It's... <laughs> I'm super excited. No, I'm super excited and it's exciting. It's like, I'm very happy that like, you know, this is the moment that Jason and I get to move in together, but it's also really nerve wracking in the sense that like, holy crap, I'm literally moving in like a couple days. <laughs> I get to say goodbye to my very first apartment. Um, I have been working so hard today. I have all of my storage closets packed. Now I just need to finish my bedroom. Pretty much the big project is my closet and my jewelry and my makeup, which hopefully shouldn't take too long. But yeah, that's kind of what we are working with right now. And yeah, so it's just kind of crazy to know that like, holy crap, I'm literally going to be moving in a couple days. So yeah. So I'm actually going to go stay with my parents tonight because obviously my bed is completely taken apart. So I'm going to go stay with my mom and stepdad until the move. So I'm definitely going to come back here during the day tomorrow because I mean I definitely need to like work on some stuff. And I'm going to work on uh, just a little bit more tonight. And then I'm going to call it quits and go to bed early so I can get up early and start my day. So I'm going to grab my suitcases and start uh, packing through like clothes for the rest of the week. And then that way I have some extra stuff for when we move. That way I don't have to like if I'm still unpacking because obviously I will be. I'm probably going to be unpacking for like a good I want to say like a good week or two. All right, you guys, so we are one day until moving day. I have absolutely everything packed right now. The only thing that I have to do is pack my dishes, which all of my plates and bowls and everything are all wrapped. Um, the only thing I just have to wrap and pack are my cups, which I'm in the process of doing, so that's not going to take me very long. And I just have to throw my makeup into a bag. Other than that, it's all done. I have everything finished, everything is packed and wrapped and ready to go. And I'm actually about to go pick up the keys for me and Jason at the new place, which I'm so incredibly excited about. And I can show you guys what the new place looks like unfurnished, which I'm like so incredibly happy about because like I just can't wait to get everything in and decorate and add more. So yeah, come along with me and you guys can get a sneak peek at what the new place looks like without furniture. And then obviously you guys are gonna see it in a couple months with furniture. So let's go. Okay, I got the keys and I'm currently in the new house right now. Oh my God, so exciting. Let's, let's give a tour. Let me start at the bottom of the stairs and I will give you guys a tour. All right, so I'm at the very bottom of the stairs. So this is our front door and let me open this. This is, Ooh, if I can get it open, this is the garage door. And you've got 
the garage. This is technically a single car garage, but this garage is like super, super long. Um, I don't think we'd be able to fit two cars in here, but I don't know, maybe we'll try, <laughs> maybe we'll try. But this is the garage. Go in here. Back, we have a cute little like landing here. And then we have our stairs. So we're gonna go up these. Another cute little little landing. Probably gonna put like a table here or something. And then we go up just this little patch of stairs here. This is our living room area. It's super nice and open. And that's what I really like about it. And we've got a beautiful window with the rest of the townhouses here. This is kind of like the dining area. And then this is the kitchen. Oh my God, you guys, this kitchen, when I saw this place, I was like, sold mine. I can't snap right now because it's super cold in here. Um, <laughs> but this is like the dining area. I'm probably gonna put my table, like honestly against like long ways. And then this is the patio. They pretty much, this is locked. I'll lock it here. This is the patio, super nice golf course view. All right, so let me go through. This is a little goodie bag that they got us, which is super sweet. Turn on the lights here. I think these turn on, I'm trying to learn. Oh, okay, so that's, that's a light switch. I'm trying to learn everything here. Um, I don't know must not turn on so this is like a hallway light okay so there's a light switch over there that must turn these on but this kitchen is humongo beautiful countertops you've got the nice freezer is this working yes it is nice size freezer like huge and lots of fridge storage which makes me so happy tons of cabinet space tons and tons of cabinet space again i didn't have that at my last apartment so the fact that this has like so many beautiful things to it i love it and this in here is like our laundry room there's a light switch that works this somewhere and i don't know where it's at but we have a stackable washer and dryer so that's just what that looks like. Everything's like so brand new. I like don't want don't want to touch it. So that's in there. And then we have the guest bathroom. So this is going to be like the main bathroom. So we have a nice just little sink, toilet, obviously, bathtub beautiful like big mirrors but this is like the main bathroom so this is like obviously the guest bathroom but like if we have friends and family come over this is the bathroom that they're going to be using and then this door shuts this goes to the main house this door actually leads to the second bedroom so if you're in the second bedroom and you need to pee you don't have to leave you can like stay here but this is the second bedroom it's nice size. We're actually going to turn this into like a game room slash like office because um, we do not have guests. <laughs> so if we have one, we're just going to get like a pull out couch. But this is like the closet. It's just a standard like just a standard closet. Nothing too, too crazy. Go ahead and shut, shut this. And then we'll go back out here. We'll open up this door. Ooh, I'm already, I'm already breaking shit, you guys. My God. No, I just bumped the other door. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so I'm gonna go around. This is the master bedroom over here. So it's a little bit bigger than the second guest room. And then Again, this window actually leads out to our balcony, which is really, really nice. 
and so we actually have a bathroom in our bedroom which is super nice it's super big i love it there's tons of countertop space which is really nice because if me and jason ever have to store anything it's not like in the sink area it's like away so tons of cabinet space again which i absolutely love your toilet you've got a nice big shower bathtub and the most exciting thing that's in here has to be the closet because we have a huge walk-in closet which makes me so incredibly happy like look at all of this there's so much storage space i'm in love hello what's up you guys um i realize i have not vlogged in a about almost a week now the last time i vlogged was when i showed you guys the empty place it's not empty anymore we obviously have stuff in it um it's fully furnished but not put together all the way yet we're still we're still working on it it's actually almost done and we're pretty much just been working on like the closets getting everything taken care of and also to just having to like figure out where we want all this extra stuff but it's been hard because like with both of us working and also school you know just trying to find time to work on it it's been difficult but i We've been working on it and I'm actually about to sit through a Zoom call for my Spanish class for an hour and yeah, and then I'm gonna make some dinner. I'll, sh um, I'll show you what I'm gonna make. So I'm actually gonna make tacos tonight, which I love tacos and Jason loves tacos. So I'm gonna make tacos, but I wanna show you guys, move my poster, the beef I'm gonna be using today. This is from Target. I have it in the fridge, so it'll kinda like thaw out a little bit. But this is the Laura's Lean Beef, the all-natural. I've never used this before, but it's 96% lean and 4% fat. So I figured it'd be really good to try. Um, it's 140 calories, if you're wondering. Um, and yeah, so I think that this is going to be really good to try obviously we're gonna season it with some taco seasoning but you never know so yeah um i'm gonna make tacos tonight it's gonna be delicious and yeah i'll talk to you guys in a little bit because i am going to go sit through my zoom class okay so this is all of the taco stuff um so i'm gonna use that beef that all natural Laura's lean beef. Um, these are the taco shells I like using because they're a little bit wider so you can really fill them. This is the old Del Paso, the 15 taco shells. These are hard shells. I love, love, love hard shells. And if you're a kiddo and they still do box tops, there's a box top. And then I do the old Del Paso taco seasoning mix. I get the, this taste exactly like the regular one it just has uh less sodium which is like less salt than the um original seasoning which you gotta watch out for your spices and stuff because that's where they like to add a lot of salt so i like to do that and then i do take some garlic powder i'm almost out of this because i use it for everything so i'm gonna have to get more but um i always take a little bit of garlic powder um just some salt and pepper I always, my family in Arizona does this, and I started doing it. Excuse my nails, by the way, they are horrendous, but I like to take a golden potato and peel it and mince it so it's really finely chopped and mix it in with the meat. Usually, I will add a potato and jalapeno. It just really, like, brings in the flavoring, and it tastes literally amazing, so I am going to do that, but um, usually I add a jalapeno as well. I usually chop up about one and a half to two jalapenos, depending how big they are. But I'm not going to do that tonight because Jason has been having some tummy problems. And whenever his stomach's kind of acting up, if he has too many spices, it can just like cause a lot of issues. So I'm not going to add any jalapeno. And then obviously like cheese sour cream hot sauce and um and what else am I gonna say I think I might make some rice to have with this so we have like tacos and rice 
and that is the dinner. I'll have to tell you guys um, how it tastes when we get it all done. So yeah, that's kind of the dinner choice we're going to be doing. Um, I'm going to start on this shortly. It's around 4.40 right now and Jason is off at uh, 5. So he should get here around like 5.10, 5.15 depending on traffic. So I'm probably going to start making dinner around 5. Um, I'll start cutting up the potato though just because sometimes that takes a little bit longer and peeling it. But I'll start dinner around 5 and it probably it'll be done by like 5 30 which i'm sure he'll shower when he gets home anyways so it works out look where we are if you guessed my old apartment you would be correct <laughs> today is the final day sorry i look so gross but today is the final day i am saying goodbye to this apartment officially um i'm sorry i'm just like walking around and making sure that like we brought everything which i know we did but you always just gotta do like the a million double checks, but um, yeah, it's officially officially done. We are moving out. Well, we already moved out, but we're turning in the keys today because um, technically I had this apartment until the end of March. Um, technically, so I know some people are going to be really confused. So my apartment. They don't prorate the lease or anything. So even though I gave my 30 days and I moved out March 13th, I still technically had the apartment until the end of March because when you pay rent, you pay for the whole month. So since I'm financially responsible for the whole month, it means I technically was able to keep this place until the end of the month. But I don't need to keep anything here anymore. I just have to mail back that router, which is on the to-do list this week, and then drop off Goodwill stuff. So that's something I'll do tomorrow because there's actually a Goodwill right next to our new house. And so we're gonna just drop some stuff off and that that's it. But yeah, this is officially goodbye to the old apartment. So she's all empty and we're about ready to say goodbye. Hey guys, so I realized I never concluded this vlog, so I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Yes, am I wearing the same t-shirt I was wearing a few days ago? Yes, I was, and I have my robe on because I was wearing a hoodie earlier, and I'm going to be honest, um, I kept like sweating, so then I'd take it off, and then I'd get cold, so I figured the robe, it's a, like, a nice happy medium. You can keep it open when you're warm, and then close it when you're cold it works great i've also been sick the last few days too which has been just very like inconvenient for me but you know it's always this time of year it's always the springtime and always like the winter time where i get sick and those are like the only two times out of the year where i get like actual like weakness nauseous sick so I've just been dealing with that and I feel a lot better today. I've been pushing a lot of fluids and everything. So yeah, just, you know, gotta love it. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I know the last time I talked to you guys was when I dropped off my keys to my old apartment. And yeah, it's officially done. I'm no longer a resident there. And now I officially live here permanently. <laughs> I mean, I have lived here since, like, we moved in, but at least I don't have to, like, worry about the other apartment anymore. So that's what's really nice about it. And, yeah, it's kind of bittersweet and crazy that, like, here we are. And I'm glad you guys enjoyed the last, like, couple moving vlogs I've had. So this is, like, the conclusion of the moving vlogs. And next video you guys are going to see is, like, a real-time my first ever sit down video in this new house besides this one but this is like you know the process in the next video you guys are gonna see are like the actual like an actual video so yeah that's exciting yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you liked it also too don't forget to subscribe down below for new videos every week and yeah Hopefully you guys are having a good day or night wherever you live and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.